we have discussed equilateral triangle and the next type of triangle that we will discuss is isosceles triangle now if you remember then uh, if you remember in an equilateral triangle all the three sides of a triangle are equal and the angles formed by the sides of that triangle will also be equal so if any one of the condition is given to you you can tell that that's an equilateral triangle in the isosceles triangle you have two sides of that of any triangle are equal only two sides two sides if only two sides of any triangle are equal then that is actually isosceles triangle and if I have to draw it let me take a rough diagram something like this If this is triangle A, B and C and if these two sides are equal, if it is given to you that sides AB, side AB is equal to side AC or if any two sides are equal then you can straight say that that triangle is an isosceles triangle. Now, if you remember then that in an equilateral triangle if you have three sides equal then all the angles are equal in this case since you have only two sides equal then if you see the side AB is intersecting side BC at, at a vertex B vertex B and it forms this angle right the side AC intersects side BC at C that is a vertex C and it forms this angle now since this side is equal to this side these two sides are equal therefore the angles formed by this side with BC is this and is and the by AC with BC is this then these two angles will also be equal that is the angles formed by the two equal sides will also be equal okay so in this case if AB is equal to AC then we will say that angle ABC is equal to angle ACB but these two will not be equal to angle BAC they will not be equal to angle BAC okay had it been a equilateral triangle then we can surely say that yes angle this will also be equal to all these angles and let's say that if if it was something like this let's say let me remove this one if it is said that if it's given to you that these two sides are equal i mean it's it would not be looking uh, looking to you very appropriate diagram if it's given that these two sides are equal let's say let's suppose if these two sides are equal in that case even in that case also it will be an isosceles triangle because the condition of an isosceles triangle is that two sides should be equal in but in that case this angle and this angle will be equal why since these two sides are equal therefore they are forming they are forming an angle this angle CAB and this side is forming an angle C B A. So if side C A is equal to side C B, then side C A intersects A B at the vertex A and it forms the angle C A B. Therefore, the angle formed by this side is angle C A B. And the angle formed by this side where it intersects at with AB at B 
it forms this angle that is angle C B A then this will be equal to C A B will be equal to C B A and in this condition it will not be equal to angle A C B. So again if two sides of any triangle are equal then that is an isosceles triangle and the angles formed by these two sides on the opposite side you know where they are intersecting the angle formed by uh, uh, by these two sides will also be equal so two sides equal then in that triangle two angles will also be equal will also be equal and what's important to note is is that those two angles will be the angles formed by those two sides only okay and not by a third side that is not equal I mean the angle formed by that side will not be equal to the other two so that is important one. 